time for a new Revengers movie. Hey everyone, Jeremy here. Today I'm about to watch the trailer for Thor Love and Thunder. I was kind of wondering when this one was going to come out. I actually was sitting here thinking that it, we probably weren't going to get it until Doctor Strange at this point because they'd kind of been holding off on showing us the trailer. I think they wanted Spider-Man to maybe come out first on Blu-ray before they did this. I don't know. I don't know how they were really thinking of doing this, but regardless we finally got it and i'm a person who actually loves the thor movies including the dark world i mean not my favorite but i still think it has enough moments that i really enjoy it and the fact that you know we're getting the god butcher in this and lady thor and oh my oh my let's see this Young Th hands were once used for battle now they're but humble tools for peace. I need to figure out exactly who I am. Nice. Ha ha ha! back and say. I will choose my own path and live in the moment. Oh my goodness, he's dressed like Star Lord. <laughs> my superhero days are over. <laughs> Is he? Remember what I told you? Was that the Greek? You ever feel lost? God. Just look into the eyes of the people that you love. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, that looks pretty great. <laughs> Let's be honest, that was pretty funny. The fact that, okay, we are getting the Guardians in this. I, I expected we had to because, you know, they kind of left together. But some things Taika has said in the past made it sound like they weren't going to be in this. But no, it looks like we're going to pick up with the Guardians. We're also going to see Thor get back into shape. So there, there's very much a sequel to Endgame happening here, and I love that about it. And the Star-Lord-Thor dynamic is perfectly intact and just wonderful. We didn't get our villain. I was really hoping we'd get to see our villain, That, but that's fine. That's fine. I can wait. I can wait. But I do, do love that we finally saw Lady Thor in action. Well, briefly. We got that tease at the very end, which, awesome. She looks so good. But the thing I took away was she's got the original Mjolnir that, that's been re- crafted put back together super glued i don't know what but it is it is the shattered mjolnir so i'm wondering how did that happen what what are we what what <laughs> what happened how did that get put back together like that and why does she have it how did she get it all those questions i i cannot wait to get answered in the movie i don't necessarily need to hear it you know now, I, I'm good with waiting, but it's just one of those, ooh, I can't wait to see and find out. That's going to be so, so much fun. And yeah, the tone, Taika's tone for these movies. Oh my goodness. So good. So good. And starting with, oh, Guns N' Roses, Guns N' Roses. Love it. Love it. Ah, all right. What did you guys think of this trailer? Leave your comments below. Are you excited about Lady Thor? Are you excited about our villain? Which I know I am. And was there something that stood out in this trailer? Whatever your thoughts, leave them in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, please hit like and subscribe. It helps the channel out immensely, and I just appreciate it a whole lot. And before I go, please take care of each other. And please take care of yourself. Thank you for watching.